Hi, my name is Brandy, but you can call me Cats. And to Hi, my name is Brandy, but you Hi, my name is Brandy, but you can call me Cats. And today I'm going to I'm not letting you interrupt me again. Today I'm going to uh, take a look at the cast in The Sims 4 Werewolves, but I can't say the F word. You know what the F word is. Uh, I'm not saying it cuz then the video ends. Anyway, let's take a look. That's going to get real annoying. This is going to get real, real annoying. I have a mod that stops them from doing any, like, uh, idle animations. But obviously that mod is not updated yet. So we're just going to have to deal with this the whole time. Shut the hell up. Okay. So first of all, did they add any new walk styles? I don't think so. No, Creepy Walk was... Or I think Creepy Walk was in... I don't remember if Creepy Walk came with it. Anyway. Any new traits? Any new traits? Any new traits? Nope. No new traits. Okay. Kind of... Kind of disappointing, but... Um, whatever. We have a new aspiration under the werewolf category. There's now a werewolf category... I have mods that add other aspirations too, So, but this is the new aspiration, Werewolf Initiate. The Sim wants to unleash his inner beast and become a werewolf. Okay. Does that change if I change the pronoun? Let's test the pronoun update real quick. Unleash her inner beast. There we go. Okay, it worked that time. Let's just go with they, them. Their inner beast and become a werewolf. It did it! It did it! Can you shut up? Shut up! This is going to drive me absolutely nuts. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. I uh, As soon as we get in game, I'm killing this sim. Um, Let me see real quick. Uh, How do you do the categories again? Oh, and I, I need to put a feminine sim in, in here as well. I almost forgot. That'll do. That'll do. I don't want to look at that yet. Don't. Don't do... Let's see what we got for the masculine sims. We got this hair. Oh, I like that hair. That's nice. It'd be nicer if you'd stop howling. We've got the mullet. Oh, that's pretty good. I'm a fan of that. Oh, I'm not a fan of that, but I'm a fan of that. Okay. So three new hairstyles for the masculine sims. What do we have for the feminine sims? Do we have any other hairstyles? Oh, we do! We do! Okay. So we've got this. Alright, that's fine. I'm fine with that. Got the, ooh, I love this. This is cute. Okay, the... it may, it's, it's made worse with the fact that the howling is very weak. It's like a very weak howl. It's not a very powerful... It's like, yeah, like that's... Try harder, you know? Do better. This. I like this. Kind of. I'm sure that will this this will be the basis of a lot of really nice CC hairs, and I'm and I'm looking forward to that. And then this is the same hair that was on the masculine sim, but for the feminine sim, I think it looks better on the masculine sim, probably because of the widow's peak. But that's nice too. We got a new nose ring. It's like two hoops instead of instead of one hoop. We got these earrings that I can't see because the hair's in the way. Let's pull it back. Okay, we got little paw print earrings. I will never use those, probably. We got, like, a matching paw print. Is that a matching necklace? Hold on. I can't see. Oh, no. It's like a tree. Okay, that's kind of a cool necklace. Um, Girl, don't do it again. We got this moon necklace. That's nice. That will be used a lot by me. The swatches. Ooh, it's like a little pride paw print. Ooh, that's cute. We have this, a blue one, a red one. So there's a tree, and then there's paw prints. Oh, and then there's like a little wolf head? Okay. Interesting. Maybe this is for like, is that a, a dollar sign with a llama? Is that a simoleon? Is this what a simoleon looks like? Hold up. That's what a simoleon looks like? It's got a llama head on it? Huh. I, I mean, I could just be making that up, but I think this is what a simoleon looks like. I have always wondered. Well, we got a little bit of lore in here. That's nice. Um, let's see, what else? Do we have any new makeup? No. 
but there's body stuff, isn't there? Because there's like, um, body scars. Yes. There's like this bite on the arm. That's gnarly. And then these scratches. Ooh. These are, these would be really terrible if they were real scars. Like, oh my god. With this scratch across the stomach. Whoa. I love these. These are fantastic. Um, the howling is not fantastic. I can't stand that. That's, oh, there's a back bite. Some more back scratches. A leg bite. Oh, I can't see the leg bite. A leg bite and a leg scratch. Oh, look how torn up she is. Those are very cool. I'm a big fan of those. The body, uh, the body scars are very cool. Now, I was kind of hoping they would add body hair. I don't suppose they've done that. Um, oh my god, the howling. The howling. Please stop. Please stop. I'm begging you. Oh my god. No, I still, I think I still just have my, yeah, my Lumia body hair. I don't, I don't think they added any body hair. But, oh, that's, that's a shame, actually. That this would have been the perfect opportunity to add it. Like how they added it in The Sims 3. Um, although I don't know which werewolves I like. I don't know. Uh, maybe I'll compare them later. But, um, the body scars I'm a big fan of. The opportunity for storytelling with these body scars is just off the charts. Now, let's get into the clothes. If you don't stop, something bad's gonna happen. I don't know what it is, but I know I know it's gonna be bad. Werewolves. Oh, hey! Oh yeah, I do remember them saying in the live stream that a lot of this was very unisex, which is fantastic. Um, let's see. We got this sweater. Very cute. We've got this little sh Oh, this is cute. I love this. This is gonna get a lot of use out of me, I think. Let's see what the other swatches look like. Oh, there's like wolf shirts underneath. Can you please stop for like one second? Oh, this is nice. This is real nice. It'd be so much nicer if he wasn't just howling. Or if they weren't just howling at the top of their lungs. And then there's this jacket. Ooh, I like this jacket with the scratched up sweater underneath. I, I have a sim in mind for this already. This Can you stop? Stop. Stop. Stop it. Anyway, so we got this jacket and um, that comes in a few different... Uh, I'm just gonna pretend it's not happening. We've got this sweater with like the laces on the shoulders. That's interesting. I haven't seen that before. You know, I don't live in like the the fashion capital of the world or anything. So this is new to me. Laces on the shoulders? What? Stop doing that. Um, this is incredible. I love this. The half tucked in. Th this is this is very good. I'm a big fan of this. I love that. I love that. I love that. I would buy the expansion just for this. But also I'm into occults and stuff, so. Got this torn up t-shirt with pins in it. Look how punk that is. Who's this? I don't know, but look at this shirt. Isn't it good? The cast, okay, so so far the cast I'm a big fan of. Oh, okay, this torn up sweater. Love that. My cats are fighting in the background. Hopefully you can't hear that. Oh, there's like a cute, a cute little moon pattern this see this is this is this one makes me sad because it looks like someone's favorite sweater got torn up and like because this would be my favorite sweater if i owned it um there's a torn up t-shirt love that loving that you know they didn't make it very discreet did they like y you can't really be a discreet werewolf and use the stuff in this pack like you have to have a wolf shirt and, <laughs> and a wolf you know a wolf cut and you have to like you have to be wearing what like it's everything is very wolfy like which i guess is fine but it's not super versatile i guess like i don't know i wish there were more swatches that were just plain and like not wolf themed like this one has a paw on it and like a little wolf patch which is super cute but like i i kind of wish it wasn't all so heavily wolf themed like this is kind of better but even the buttons are like moons which is very cute once again a very cute detail but you know, what if I want to just use it on a regular sim? Um, I guess I could pretty easily go in and, like, fix that myself, though. So I'm not too, like, upset about it, really. Like, I'm not 
fuming or anything, but I do kind of wish that there were some... Like this. This is nice. Like, just the blue plain. Can you shut up? Just the blue plain swatch. This sweater is very nice. It's, this is going to be good for a lot of stuff, you know. Um, let's see. What about the bottoms? Okay, we got some torn up jeans with like a weird... What is that? Is this a... Is that like a patch? Like, what is... That's so weird. It's like... Huh. Never seen anything like that before. Like I said, I don't live in the fashion capital of the world or anything, but this is all new to me. Look at that. I'm just, I'm just like seeing this for the first time and I'm like, wow, what? That's crazy. Look at that. Um, these is like some torn up jeans with some more jeans underneath and then more jeans underneath that, which is an interesting choice. I don't know how often I will use these. Um, cause it does look like you put, like, <laughs> it looks like your Sim bought a pair of jeans, tore them up bought the same pair of jeans, put them on over that pair of jeans, tore those up, and then bought the same pair. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's what it looks like. Um, maybe that's what it's supposed to look like. Maybe that's the theme, you know? We've got these, like, leathery pants. I'm pretty sure we have something very similar to these in the vampire pack, don't we? Uh, and I don't know how practical these pants would be for a werewolf, but it comes in a lot of bright colors, so that's fun, I suppose. We've got some torn-up shorts. Ooh, I like the torn-up shorts. Those are very nice. With the pockets sticking out. Yeah, big fan of the torn up shorts. Now let's see, are there any... Oh, hold on. I didn't look for outfits. Oh, I think those are it right there at the top, but I'm gonna filter them anyway. All right. Looking a little bit like a, like an essential oil salesperson or something like that. I'm liking that. Big fan of that. Like a Hogwarts professor, maybe, that sells essential oils. Like, giving me big Professor Trelawney vibes. Um, This outfit is adorable. This is stunning. Huge fan of this. Huge fan of this. Oh, look at the little... Look at the little... Oh, look at the little cottagecore mushrooms. And then the little moon. Oh, with little paw prints. Very cute. Once again... Very wolf-themed, but very cute. Extremely cute. Accessories. I don't ever want to see this sim again when I'm done with this. Can we... Oh, hold on. Hold on. Don't look at that yet. We got a bracelet. Hold on. Can't see the bracelet. Can't. Still can't see the bracelet. Let's give him the torn-up outfit. So we've got this bracelet that I would love to take a closer look at. A lot of this stuff would be good for spellcaster sims too, which I'm very thrilled about because I have like a big spellcaster family that I play with all the time. So that's very fun for me. Ooh, we got like a bandaged hand. We could do that for, for oh, one hand or the other hand, not both hands. Okay. Interesting. Interesting choice. We've got like a little ring, a little moon ring. Is that what that is? Can you, um... Mm -hmm. Yeah, just go ahead. Let it all out. Let it all out, bestie. We've got another, it looks like another moon ring. Uh, I don't know that we needed two moon rings, but they are they both look cute, I think. I can't really see them. They're very small. And then we've got this ring that I can't really see as either. It's just like very shiny. Is that what that black is? Or is there a pattern on it? Or is it supposed to be something? I can't tell. I can't tell what that one's supposed to be. We've got these nails that are like, oh, like a gradient. They look like kind of dingy nails like you know like maybe some that a werewolf might have that's very cool fan of that and there's also like some cuter ones like some pink oh i like that a lot and then we've got like a reverse of that gradient and like darker at the tips those are very cool i think i have some that are kind of custom content like that and then we have these claws baby these lovely claws with this lovely hand reminiscent of that which must not be named. Very cool. Loving that. Loving that. Huge fan. I'm going to give them these nails. Uh, I don't suppose there's anything particularly different in the feminine accessories. Oh, there's these. Okay. There's some torn up leggings. And there's, it looks like there's some extra nails, too. Huh. Are these, like, glittery? Like, sparkly nails? Huh, those are cute. I like that. 
I should have done can't say the word cute because that's a lot harder to do than than this one that I'm anyway it doesn't matter and then were there any other clothes yes there is there's a lot more okay wow let's go to the tops I don't think we saw this this looks like it's for feminine sims that's fine I guess I don't know <laughs> I don't have a strong opinion on that and then are there any other some like there's a skirt that I can't see because the top is too big oh once again with the moon a lot of moons a lot of moons is there any swatches that don't have a moon it does not appear that there are any swatches that don't have a moon it looks like every swatch does have a moon so in order to use the skirt your sim has to be very into moons or a werewolf what about these shorts those shorts are okay those are oh, those are interesting wait is that Hold on, let me take the leggings off real quick. Oh, okay, so there's like a little tie in the back instead of, that's that's interesting. Oh, but there's also a button in the front? Huh. Interesting shorts, an interesting pair of shorts. I like the bow, it's cute. Oh, this is like a skirt with a coat tied over it, okay. And there's like some texture there, like it's actually, it looks like very flat though, doesn't it? Like just because it it's got a hood with like fur on it, so it looks like it would be a bulkier jacket, but it's just not. It's just like flat against her, you know, figure. It is it is nice though. I like it. And then these are just the torn up shorts, I think. Yeah. Okay. And then we do have some new feminine outfits. Let's have a look at this. Ooh. Oh, I love this. Oh, I love this. I can look at the little pouch with the flowers in it. <gasps> no. Oh, you can't be serious. Let me see the other swatches. Did the flower colors change with the swatches? Oh, I have a sim in mind for this too. I already know who I'm going to put in this. Oh. Oh. Oh, imagine a little witch wearing this. Oh, okay. What? Look, let me look at this before I get carried away. This is nice too. I like this. Not as much as that last one, but once again, very wolfy. Okay, here we have some swatches that are not wolfy. Um, not looking at that yet. Some swatches that are not wolfy. This is an interesting swatch. All right. I like it. And then we've got this. This is just super cute. Super cute, super versatile. Love this. A little patched up, but not like Oh, it looks like the the patch on here has some wolf stuff on it, but like the main swatch, I don't think. Yeah, it's just flowers. So yeah, that's not super wolfy. My cat is screaming in the background, and I do not know if you can hear it or not. And I do apologize if you can hear it. Um, I'm sure I'm the way that I'm going about looking at these swatches, which is just clicking randomly on the. I'm sure that's pissing some people off. But, well, no, you know what? It's not pissing some people off because there's like four people watching this video and they're all fine. They're probably fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. Anyway, look at this. Stop howling. Okay, this isn't Wolfie in the slightest, I don't think. Yeah, unless there's like a secret patch on the back. No, there's not. Okay, very cute. And once again, like, I'm not mad at the Wolfie outfit choices and stuff like that. I get it. It's a werewolf's pack. Like, it's very cute and I love it. But I like to have the option to have like a plain swatch as well so that it's not wolfy so that I could put it on my other Sims. You know what I mean? And I think that makes sense. I, I don't feel bad about having that opinion. Are there any new shoes? Looks like yes. Looks like a resounding yes. There's these. Moon Converse. Okay. And there's some plain swatches of these as well. Okay, I like these. Ooh, that's cute too. All right. There's like a paw print on the front. Um some dirty converse. Oh, that's really good. The dirty con Oh, yeah, I'm going to use those a lot. There's these like boots. These are um what's the word? Hideous? Uh, <laughs> these these are absolutely revolting to me and i don't know why maybe it is it these are 
I do not like these. I feel like I have these already in CC form in so many better, like, like they look so much better. Um, that being said, they're probably fine. I'm sure they're whatever. We've got some busted up shoes. All right. Some busted up shoes. That makes sense. Yes. Let me see if there's any. No, it's just the same. Okay. The, the horrible, horrible boots. The, the those and the, the dirty converse. Okay. All right. Yeah. I'm a fan of the shoes select. Well, no, I'm not a fan. I'm a fan of two thirds of the shoe selection. So that's pretty good. That's not bad. I think that's it for the clothes and accessories and stuff like that. So, um, I guess it's time for us to get to the, the beast form, uh, and have a look at that. I'm not stalling. I just want to make sure I got everything. Looks like I did get everything. Um, no new torn up socks or anything. Um, kind of wish that they had done. I, these are CC. These are not from the base game. So there's that. And okay, let's just do it. Let's just go. <laughs> it gave them blue eyebrows. It gave them blue eyebrows. Stop howling, please. I have to look at your face. Oh my god. Oh no. I don't know how I feel about about these. I can we Yeah, okay. Um So this is the this is the beast form. Um it just wears the same clothes as your sim, I think. And there's like some different ear choices. Some like torn up ears, some little these are like bobcat ears. Those are like not wolf at all. This one's like got like partially missing ear. This is like super missing ear or super short ears, I guess. And then there's this and there's like a floppy ear. <laughs> And there's like a double floppy ear. And there's cheek tufts. <laughs> there, you can have like less cheek tuft. Or you can have more cheek tuft. Um, I wish you would just look at me so that I could see. You can have a different nose, I, I suppose. You can have this kind of nose. I think these are just like presets like that. Um, in the live stream, they showed that the sim will change. Their their beast form <laughs> will change um, depending on their base sim form. So if I like take the take the mouth and like pull it out, then the yeah the the mouth will sort of be pulled out as well in the in the beast form. So that's um. Interesting. Chin tufts. Okay. Alright. Yeah, so you can do kind of like a more full beard. Oh. T uh, the teeth. These are custom content teeth, so ignore those. But looks like we've got some like crooked or like broken teeth, like missing fangs. Okay. I like that. Do, do, do they have different teeth for the for like the base game sims too? No. No. Okay. Just checking. Um it's a shame. That's a shame. I kinda wish I could give the base sim the more wolfy fangs as well. Whew I am getting really sick of you doing that. Uh <laughs> So the whole business is very like it's it's an anthropomorphic wolf and okay so if you go anyway if you go into detail edit mode no that's not how you do it apparently how do you i know it's they said you could like paint the fur on the body of the ah there it is coat color and pattern paint mode oh oh okay so we've got like some base colors let's let's take off the clothes so we can see the we've got like some some base colors and you can change those 
however you want. And the, oh my goodness, yes, queen. And then there's this one and this one, this one and this one. Oh, that one's interesting. This one and this one and this one and even this one, if you can believe it. This is like a snow leopard. <laughs> um, they don't have tails, so, you know, there no tails. Um, and then there's this. Oh, and these even have their own swatches, so you can, you can have, like, a fun Raggedy Ann werewolf with, like, different color, like a, a it's like a patchy, or you can have a skeleton werewolf, um, or, and you can change the colors. Uh, oh my god, that is something, isn't it? That is, um... Oh, that's fun. So that's the beast mode. That's And that's the beast mode. And that's it. That's what it looks like. And I don't, I don't think it looks much different for feminine sims. No, it doesn't really. It's pretty much the same. I mean, obviously her body shape is different. So the body shape is a little different. But like, it's, it's, you know, it's not like... They didn't give it, they didn't give the feminine one, like, big old booba or anything like that. Which is, I think, fine. <laughs> I'm totally okay with that. Um, some people were very upset about that, if you can believe it. Some people were, like, livid. You know, they were like, give the give the werewolf lady boob. And, and the Sims team was like, no, you perverts. And... I can't say I blame them. I can't say I blame them. Anyway, let's get into paint mode and get a little wacky with it, shall we? So you can straight up just paint on the body. You can do whatever you want on the... So if you really wanted to, you could, like, paint boob... You could, like, paint boob onto the... You know, like that? Um. Oh, I didn't mean to leave it. Sorry, I meant to take that off of you. Um, but this is very, I think this, people are going to be doing some really cool stuff with this. I can already tell, uh, and I'm excited about it. Um, honestly, the whole thing, I mean, like, listen, I know a lot of people are upset about the beast mode. They're upset about the, what is it called? The beast form. A lot of people think that the beast form is very reminiscent of a certain crowd. and I think that those people are not wrong, but I also think that it's not necessarily a problem, is it? Right? Like, why? What's what's the what's the problem? It's an anthropomorphic wolf, all right. And if you want to call them furries, 